The input quantize feature snaps incoming MIDI notes to the grid markers of your song. This is useful if you want to use Mega Sampler as a live performance tool and trigger samples perfectly in time. When input quantize is set to none, no quantization will occur and you'll be able to freely play MIDI notes. With input quantize set to one quarter, incoming MIDI notes are snapped to the nearest upcoming grid marker in quarter note intervals. You either need to trigger a note a little bit early or right on the grid marker that you want the MIDI note to play. I'm going to trigger this sample using my MIDI keyboard way early and you'll hear that it only plays on quarter note grid markers. The sample won't trigger at any other point in time. Selecting 1 8 snaps incoming MIDI notes to the nearest grid marker in 8th note intervals. This means that you can trigger a sample up to 8 times per bar in 4-4 time. And you guessed it, 1 16th snaps incoming MIDI notes to the nearest grid marker in 16th note intervals. Triggering a sample with your cursor in Mega Sampler overrides input quantization. I'm using the quarter note input quantize setting, but you'll hear that this sample ignores that when I click on it. You might be able to find a unique use for this, so I thought it was worth mentioning.